Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Joey Biagas and I'm a digital media expert. And today I'm gonna to show you how to separate your sync songs in iTunes. So let's get to that. Okay, I have iTunes open here. Now what you wanna do is head over to the top right corner over here. And this is where your iDevice is going to be, whether it's an iPhone or an iPad. So click on that. And then we have the basic summary here. What we wanna do is we wanna cruise down because we have a couple options down in our options section here. Okay, if we take a look, sync only checked songs and videos. That means you can select the specific songs, uh, let's say you have a playlist or a specific album that you want to transfer over to your iPhone, um, it's only gonna sync the ones that you have check marked off. Now if we cruise down a little bit, we have manually manage music and videos. That's what I like to have checked off, and I would recommend doing that, especially if you have a very, very large uh, iTunes library, and you don't wanna go through syncing the entire library every single time. And let's say you just wanna add a song or two to your iDevice, you can simply do that by checking off the manual manage music and videos. Okay, and also we have another option here under music to separate our sync songs. If we do want to sync our entire music library, we can check mark off the synced music and this is going to, like I said before, uh, sync the entire music library. Um, we also have a couple of different options within synced music here. We have uh, not only entire music library, but selected playlists, artists, albums, and genres, and also, of course, include music videos and voice memos. Um, but like I said before, I'm not a real big fan of that. I like to manually do it because I do have a larger iTunes library. But that's uh, a couple different ways for you to separate your synced songs. That way um, you have your choice of the specific way you want to sync your iDevice. So there you guys go. That's basically it and how to sync or separate your synced songs on iTunes. If you do have any other questions, please let us know. And thank you for watching.